Here I got buried diary desktop. The computer was overheating and the fan noise was terrible on this machine. I guess I know why it's making lots of noise. Do you see the dust inside the heat sink? That's why it's overheating. We're gonna get rid of all the dust first and then I'm gonna apply new thermal compound for better, even better cooling efficiency. Let's do it. Let's blow them off. And look at the dust on the power supply unit. That's so bad. Let's blow them off too. Look at the fan and the power supply uh, air vent. It looks so much better than before. But we're not done yet. We're gonna uh, replace the existing thermal grease with a new one. To do that, we need to remove this heat sink and a cooler. On this one, it's an AMD A10 processor. We can just release this plastic lever like that. And let me unplug the CPU cooling cable. Then we'll be able to take it off without any trouble. Just like that. Okay, the processor just comes off. It's not normal, but it happened. Let me see if there's any damage. Luckily, it looks okay, but this shouldn't happen because the CPU should remain in this CPU slot right there. Because it's locked, the CPU shouldn't come off like this. Probably this is a sign of the dried out thermal grease between the heatsink and the processor. Let me carefully remove this processor from the heatsink and I will apply new thermal compound. Do you see this? Uh, it's actually stick to the heatsink. Oh, now, okay, I twisted it and then, yeah, there you go, it was easy, it was easier than I thought. We're gonna uh, apply new thermal compound because uh, this thing looks like pretty much dried out. Wow. And then I'm gonna use this Arctic Silver 5 apply this on this processor for better cooling efficiency. I know this is the one of the best in the market. Okay, let's install this processor. Press down this metal lever. And then we can install this cooler. Let's turn it on and see how smooth it runs. Okay, this is very surprising because if you look at the temperature of the processor, before at idle, it was reaching 80 to 85 degrees Celsius. It's like 10 to 20 degrees Celsius cooler than before. Okay, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave comments. I'll do my best to answer your question. Bye.